Hello everyone, let's try to solve this question together. Which one is a true statement regarding hyperbilirubinemia and phototherapy in neonates? Pause the slide and look at all the options. Okay, let me walk you through. So A, it is necessary to check the infant's blood type if the mother is O positive and she has a negative uh, antibody screen. The answer is no, it's not necessary because mom has a negative antibody um, screen. Choice B, an infant who is born to RH negative mother with a DART only positive for NTD should be treated as having no risk factor for, for hyperbilirubin and neurotoxicity. This looks like a right answer, but let's go through C and D before we commit on B. C, if the mother received RHIG during pregnancy, the infant's DART status could be false positive. No, it will be positive because, uh, you know, this could cross placenta and, 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 and give a positive result. Uh, what about D? An infant treated with RHIG for positive anti-RH in early pregnancy, the infant is treated of having no risk for neurotoxicity. No, this is wrong because this mom has a positive NTD status before the Reogam was given, so this baby is high risk for neurotoxicity. Um, this is, you know, this is the right choice here, but again, this is debatable. You guys can read about it, and this is taken from the key action statement one and figure one from the uh, American Academy of uh, Pediatrics. Please uh, do comment. Have a good day. Bye.